Hey, I haven't been uh, on YouTube for a long time and Heather asked me if I would do a 4th of July design. So I'm going to do something super, super fast and super, super simple. Uh, mostly I'm going to use the Paradise um, Prisma Cake on the 4th of July colors and I'm going to use uh, probably these three brushes. I'm not really sure yet because I'm kind of making it up as I go along. And then I got a couple little uh, jewels that I bought for the 4th of July motif, okay? All right, so like I said, we're gonna keep it very simple. So I'm gonna start with the lighter colors, the white and the blue, with a smaller brush. And then I'm going to do it around her eyes first. Okay, so close your eyes. And then I'm gonna come over here. I'm gonna do this. Okay. Then I'm gonna do the same thing on the other eye. Okay. okay, now I'm going to take the bigger brush and I'm going to go with the darker colors. I'm going to go out with the darker colors. I love the Prisma Cakes. I think they're just so creamy and so nice. I just really, really like them. Okay, so I'm going to come over here, but I'm going to, I want the blue to be here and the red to be on the outside. So I'm just going to lay it down, lay it down, and lay it down. And then maybe just a little bit over here. Then I'm gonna do the same thing by going in this direction. I'm gonna lay it down, lay it down, and lay it down. And then I'm gonna take the tip and just fill it in. Or sometimes what I do is I just take a dry sponge and kind of blend everything together. Great. Now I'm gonna do my famous teardrops. And that's going to be my next um, video on Fava TV. A hundred teardrops, the science using nothing but teardrops, because I'm the jewel queen and the teardrop fanatic. Okay, so I'm gonna, I have white and a little bit of red mix. So I'm gonna start here with a teardrop going this way, a teardrop going this way towards the focal point, another one towards this focal point. With the here, so it'll be the white would be more white. Okay, and then I'm going to do a reverse this way in the same direction. All right, that looks very pretty. So far, so good. Close your eyes. Okay, now before I finish it, we're going to decorate it. I'm going to take some of these little jewels that have the red, white, and blue. And then I'm going to figure out do I want to put them this way or do I want to put them this way? So I think I'll go this way. So I'm going to start right over here. I'm going to go all the way to the end. I'm going to just stick. Okay. And then I'm going to bring it down this way too with the other one. And then I'm going to put it right here. Just bring it in. Okay, so now we're just going to finish it. And I'm going to go back with the um, darker blue and I'm just going to outline everything, add a couple extra little stars in the middle. Okay. Okay, so I'm just outlining everything with blue. A couple more teardrops over here. Outline this one with the blue. And then more teardrops over here. Okay. And last but not least, I'm going to take some of these tiny little stars and I'm going to see where they fit. Okay. And I want to keep it going in this direction, so I'm going to put some bigger ones and some smaller ones. All right. So in between here, I'm just going to fill it in with details, detailed little dots. I'm going to go just a little tight over here. Okay. And I'm just going to look back and see where can I put a couple more detailed dots filling the spaces right over here okay and of course right over here okay and just a little bit of lipstick and we finish of course close it up I like to do the lipstick starting from the inside from the outside in the bottom there. 
And a little bit of glitter, which I didn't bring. Do you have any there? No? Okay. And then I think just a little bit of glitter will finish it up, but this is it. Thank you so much for mm -hmm. being here, and uh, we'll see you again really soon.